Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, in this video, I'll be showing how to delete records using the delete query in JDBC. And uh, so the, basically what I will be doing is using the delete query to delete some records of my table, but in JDBC. So I've already posted videos on how to delete, update, or uh, the using clauses or uh, the basic MySQL queries. So you can, if you want, you can refer those videos. The only difference is that this is that was plain SQL queries, and these are uh, SQL queries only, but using JDBC, that is Java programming. So let's get started. Now the first thing that I uh, that I always do is to create connect the class with uh, this file with the database. So for that we use uh, class dot name, and in that bracket I just pass this MySQL path. Sorry, driver. Next I'll do is connect, uh, create the connection object and start it. Driver manager. I've also posted how to connect this, uh, oh, sorry, this program with the database. Uh, those videos are also posted. If you want, you can refer those videos. Local host 3307 is the port number and GDBC1 is my database name. You can have the database name as whatever you have stored. This is my username of the uh, MySQL. This is my password of MySQL. You have to write your MySQL passwords and username. Next thing, uh, I'll just write a system dot out dot print alone statement saying that the connection is successfully done. Or just saying that connecting to the database right um, next is now there is a delete uh, delete functionality which we have to perform for that I will be using a statement so first we'll start with the statement object creating statement object is the empty equal to null then my query in string SQL equal to uh, I have to delete a record, so I'll simply write as delete from. Yeah, I want to show this thing. I've already created this table register. This uh, was created in my one of the previous videos of inserting or uh, deleting. Oh, sorry, inserting and creating of tables. So this was a table I've created. These are the data entries which are present, and uh, so I'll write as delete from register. This is my table name. And I'll write this where now oh, suppose I want to delete a record of an entry. Suppose I take 10. All right. So I'll write where ID equal to 10. Before the statement, I have to write this. I have to initialize this. So statement is equal to con dot create statement. I have to initialize this statement. So this is it, and then we have to just execute the query. That is execute update. Stmt dot execute update. That's it. Quite simple. And then again a simple sy statement saying the data is being deleted. Right. Uh, just save it. If there are errors. I'll just write here throws exception. All right, that's it. This has to work. Yeah, you can see that the data is deleted. This is printed now. If you just refresh in my table, you can see the tenth entry is deleted. All right, so this was using the statement. Now the next uh, concept that I will, I mean, the next type through which we can delete it is to use prepared statements. So I'll just show how it works. Prepared statements, I have already discussed how the, what is the difference between the prepared statement and the statement in my previous videos. So if you want, I can tell you again that prepared statement takes the runtime values. It is, uh, 
creates an object of prepared statement and uh, it it's uh, it creates an object for sending the parameterized sql statement to the database all right where a statement does not do uh, anything of such uh, functionalities it is basically uh, just uh, used to execute the queries at the uh, compile time itself so we have to give values here in the statement well in prepare statement we can give that values as question mark that is uh, that is known as a parameterized values i'll just show it stmt is my second object which i'll be creating then i'll write as con dot prepare statement and then i'll be passing sql one i'll just write the query up here string sql1 is my another query using prepared statement so i'll write as update sorry not update delete delete uh, from register where id i don't know so i'll put a question mark all right so this is known as the parameterized query this is known as parameter query so that query uh, that parameter value is i'll put it right now and below so i'll write as stmt one dot uh, set now uh, remember id is integer value so i'll take a set integer in that we take two uh, two parameters it has two parameters first parameter is the parameter suppose now uh, we have written is uh, delete from register where you can write as name is this and id equal to this so the name is the first parameter and id is the second parameter now here there is only one parameter hence we are taking one if there would have been one more that uh, suppose name is this and uh, suppose uh, first name sorry first name equal to question mark so this this would be the second parameter so then i will be writing here is uh, let me just import this header first so i would have just been uh, writing here a statement stmt1 dot set string suppose now this is a string and then i will write here as two because this is a second parameter and then the corresponding values which i want to put inserted but now that uh, that isn't the case so let's just remove this part there's only one parameter so set integer value is uh what did i tell yeah i've already deleted the 10th uh, record so i'll suppose now delete the ninth record so i'll write as nine okay if you want you can delete any random record i don't want to be in sequential form so i'll take as four all right so i'll take as four semicolon and then execute it so for that we'll write as execute update so that is statement dot one dot execute update now in this update we don't have to pass the sql this thing as a parameter because that we have already done in creating while preparing this sql so just taking some time to process we'll just hold off for a minute yeah so we can write as execute update this one and i'll not be passing here any sql as i had done here but because this was using statement and this is using prepared statement we have already passed here sql so no, there's no need again i'll just copy this thing again just to make sure my this uh, part is working second time all right i'll save it and i'll just show this part okay yeah i'm just organizing and doing nothing else okay i will i'm saving it by control s but if you want to see it's going to save it now run it hopefully it should run yeah so here you can see there are two sentences that is connecting to the database database is data is deleted data is deleted for the second time so i'll just refresh this table and the fourth record has to be boom it's gone so this is what i wanted that is the fourth record is gone and so this is how we do is deleting of a record using the statement a prepared statement and statement where where in one part we are hard coding and sending the value of id or the name or whatever record a specific record we have mentioning whereas in second also we are doing the same but 
in the starting query we are making it as parameterized query all right so this is how we deleted uh, a record you in JDBC using delete query so if you have any questions regarding the previous uh, or if you have any doubts regarding uh, any of these uh, connecting to the database and all you can refer to the previous videos if you have any questions you can ask me in the comment below I'll answer your questions and thank you so much for watching please don't forget to like subscribe and share thank you